Hi everyone, it's June here. Today I wanted to show you or share with you what I've been um, using my washi tape for. And that is decorating some of my envelopes. I'll show you the ones I have done. So I think these two are my favourite. Um, I love to see either gold or silver on black. So we have those two. I haven't put anything on the back yet. Two strips of silver on there. And we've gone vertical with that one. And on the white envelopes, um, I, I do have a limited selection of washi tape. Um, I should have said that at the beginning. I'm going to order some Christmassy ones for the same purpose, for envelopes and putting it inside um, several cards. So we have Happy Birthday along there. The overhang that was on there was happy, so I just um, pop that onto the back. We have this pretty pink and then I've added that to the flap. Diagonal again. I've used three on there and just two on here. And for the white envelopes, I think this one is my favourite because I've covered the whole of the flap on there, which you could do if you wanted to. But I really, really like that. I think, you know, we spend quite some time making a card for someone special. And it is a shame if you just, in my opinion, I should say, if you just pop this gorgeous card into a plain envelope. What I do tend to do is um, if I'm making a card and it has a flower stamp, any stamp actually, I will incorporate that with the envelope, stamping in the corner or down the side, maybe on the back. I do um, do that. And if I'm stamping, obviously I can use the same colours that I've used on the card itself. So there you are. Very simple to do. I'm just going to um, use one envelope. You, you probably already do this yourselves. Um, so what I will do is two gold and one silver, I think. And I like the diagonal look. I also, with, well, black and white envelopes, or any colour, I like to leave a little border between the strips. Just think it looks nicer, in my opinion. And what I would also recommend to do is when you have added your washi tape, just ensure to burnish that well into place. And then remove the excess. Don't throw that away because you can use that to hold down your dies when you're die cutting or anything else actually not just uh, for dies I think as well what I would do with these cards the, sorry, these envelopes the black ones um, when I have it addressed with the recipient's details on there I would use a strip of one of either the gold or the silver 
and I put it along the flap closure as well. And what I'm going to do, I'll do this off camera. I've just seen, I've um, not added enough tape on there. So I'll remove that and keep it to keep my dies in place when I'm die cutting or something like that. Um, but there you are. I just think it's so nice and it'll be so nice for the recipient to firstly have a lovely decorated envelope and then a nice card inside. So thank you again for spending a little bit of time with me and until the next video, take care. Bye.